Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm your host Rosalinda. Hola. Thank you so much for being here and of course, Happy New Year! Yeah. Say Happy New Year. No? <laughs> happy New Year from me and the kids, the children. Say hi. You gonna say hi? Oh, one of them is already grumpy. It's too early, it's the morning and it's so cold. So we have made it to Pasadena. Welcome to the Rose Parade vlog. So I think I already mentioned then that we do this every year, me and Raul and Raul's family. We have been doing this for like the last couple of years. Um, but I think the last two years, me and Raul have been coming by ourselves. But then when we were like at New Year's Day or New Year's Eve, we we're like, okay, are you guys gonna go, yes or no? Let's get it going because it's really fun. It's a nice tradition that we have going. But I know that it's like a lot because usually the Rose Parade is on New Year's Day, like on January 1st. But since January 1st fell on a Sunday this year, they don't do the parade on Sundays. So it landed on January 2nd, which is today. So I think it was like better because um, then people are not like hungover, they're like they sleep more, they're not like sleep deprived. So I think it's like, it was good for everybody. And it was easier to get up even though it's still cold supposed to be the coldest right now at six and seven at 41 degrees Ooh. if you guys are not familiar with Pasadena it's like really close to the mountains like the, you can see the mountains and it gets like so much colder because you're so close to the mountains so um, it's freezing I'm always freezing I have like five layers look look at me five you layers? yeah how many layers do you have you're fine like that I have two. Three, you have two three, three layers you, Nico? <laughs> I have like five layers. I have a tank top, I have a long sleeve, I have my little Columbia sweater, I have this long coat that goes all the way down, my jeans, and then my boots have fluff inside. Same. They're furry. Oh, see? Girl, and I have this beanie that says R for Rosa. Look, did you guys notice my beanie? No. no. It has an R for Rosa. <laughs> and I have my gloves. Girl, I'm ready. So we're already walking over there. Um, we ended up parking a little bit different this year. We parked on closer to where the parade starts. We usually go to Colorado, like kind of downtown area, Colorado. But this time we try to come closer to where it's going to start because then we'll be like, then we won't have to wait that long for the parade to get to us. So this is a new place where we parked. We're waiting for everybody else. Look at where they are, all the way over there. And hopefully we get a nice viewing. Yes? <laughs> okay, we made it. Yeah. Evelina's here. Hello. And then Bella over here. Where are you, Bella? Oh, right here. <laughs> okay, we're walking on the main route on Colorado Street. We found a place. I'll show you guys when we get back. But I wanted to walk in the middle of the street because it's always so much fun. <laughs> Look, all the people here. There's like so many people just walking in the middle before it opens. It's like 7.30, huh? Oh, thank you. <laughs> look, you guys, that's the college I went to. And look at, yeah, look at all the people over there. I went to PCC for two years. Like right out of high school, we did that two years and then I transferred out. But the I love this school. Sure. Yeah, it's so pretty right here. I love Pasadena. <laughs> okay, during our walk, I was like, I need to go restroom before it starts and I have to finish this this coffee. It's like, let's see if we can find a non porta potty because I think all the restaurants open are not going to let you use the bathroom. So then we came into uh, PCC, it was open. So let's see if we can find a restroom. Okay, I really want to go before. You guys, this is my favorite part. parked on Michigan and Colorado. Look at those kids on the window. <laughs> but as you saw, the bombers already came, which is the most fun part. I love seeing those things fly by. They're so fast and so loud and everybody always goes, Woo! Did you like the bombers? No? They were so loud. <laughs> I love it. They're so much fun. But last year, we saw them until 8.15 and this year that we're closer we saw them at 8.04 so we are definitely a little bit closer oh, wow. the um, 
We asked somebody and they said that we're like in the middle. So we're already closer to the parade than before. Oh, well, it has officially started. It's gonna be loud. Thanks to Ricardo. Oh, look at there's people in the room. That's my other school, my university. Woo! So pretty.
But now when they're towing the cars, huh? That's a wrap, guys. It's done. Woo. And right now, we're actually on our way to pick up our couch! Okay, so if you were on my stories on Instagram yesterday, I posted a picture of a couch. And it was on hold for me, Rosalina, because we got a couch, you guys. But I feel like that's another story for another day. I know. But yeah, we ended up getting a couch yesterday on Sunday. We went to Bob's. Once I set up the couch and stuff, I'll tell you guys all about it. But we did get a couch. But the parade was so much fun, like always. It was an adventure every year. Siempre, like, nada like que pasa algo, but it's never the same. Like, it's never the same place where we end up. It doesn't, like, always, we don't always get there smoothly or at the same time. And the weather, of course. But regardless, it was a lot of fun. They did seem to have like a little bit more technical difficulties because there was like a lot of big gaps in between the floats, huh? Yeah. And then this year we did end up like setting up closer than we've ever been before to like the start of the parade. So we thought like it, the floats were going to get to us like faster, but they, they had all those like technical difficulties. So it did take a while because the bombers pass at 8.04 which like we've never heard them pass that soon they always get to us like around 8 15 8 30. they got there at 8 4 but then the first float didn't come until 8 30 and we were like pretty close to the front so i don't know i think this year they had a lot of technical difficulties but it was still fun the floats are always beautiful so pretty with all the flowers with everything as you so um like they put them all together i feel like it's so creative and so beautiful. I love it. We are parade people. You guys already know that. We love parades, me and Wichino and his family. And this is again the year that we all came back together as a family because the past two years it's only been me and Wichino. But now we're like, okay, if you guys are gonna go, we have to make this plan and all go together. One of the kids did fall asleep, Vincent, he didn't make it. And then Raul's brother, little brother, ended up buying the kids those horns. That's why it was so loud throughout the whole thing. I was like, oh my gosh, we're that family. And then later on, some other like Hispanic family parked behind us. And they were also so loud. Like in the videos, you guys are gonna hear the kids were like, Happy New Year! Happy New Year! Like they were just screaming that the whole time. So we are like, we were like that family. We were loud in like that little area. But anyways, it was still a lot of fun. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Thank you for coming along. The parade, the Rose Parade is always so much fun. If you do live in LA, like if you want to make it a tradition, it's such a nice tradition to do with your family. If you want to come like once, you know, one and done and you'll get your experience. It's a nice experience and like memories to create with your family as well. I really like it. I. I hope that we can um, bring our kids, when we have kids, we bring them to the parade too because it's it's fun. It's a lot, like with kids, it's a lot because I see all the parents and then I, like we have the kids with us too. But it's still like really nice memories to hold and cherish. So if you guys wanna do it, if you live in the um, LA area, I suggest that you do it at least once. What do you think, Wichiro? At least once. <laughs> Yes, that's how we started. We're like, we'll just do it one time, but we liked it, and we didn't. We found it that like it's not super difficult to find parking and stuff. It's just like 
what, whether you get there at a certain time. And this is the first year that we actually sat down, huh? Because all the other years we've only stand up. Yeah. This year we sat down the whole time we had chairs, so yeah, we're improving every year. But thank you so much for coming along. I wish you a happy, happy new year. Welcome to the new year of 2023 where all your dreams and your wishes shall come true, girl. Thanks a lot. I'll see you all in the next video. Bye. Happy new year. Happy new year. Peace. <laughs>